Guys, it's Hazy here, bringing another YouTube video, and today we got a we got a story about one of my uh, old teachers, and she taught language arts. And you know, for the sake of this video, let's uh let's call her Miss Retard. It seems about right. So uh, let's just start this out. Uh, most people in my class didn't like her. She you know, she didn't have the best way of dealing with problems. Wasn't the best teacher. Um, yeah, no, no, I really liked her honestly, and she's pretty sexist too. Like if, like, say there's a group of boys talking, she get mad at them, and I'm sure like some of them they get moved or they get detentions or someone gets sent to the principal's office. But if there's a group of girls and they're talking, the teacher just like doesn't even care, and just things like that happened all the time. And like one time, a guy even got attention for not drinking his water. Um, someone else got attention for getting punched. That was one of them. And then uh, one of my friends actually got a detention for um, uh, looking up towards the teacher. Yeah, she she didn't like that. She sent to the principal's office for that. So yeah, that's that's the kind of that's kind of teacher she was. So yeah, this happened uh, one day where we were like we had a paper due soon actually, and we only have five computers in the classroom. And she's like, "Oh, you don't have to type out your computers. You guys can handwrite them too." But then you'd handwrite your paper, then she'd hand it back to you and say that she can't read it. Then you have to redo it. So most of us would just type it, and five people were typing, so the rest of the class like had nothing to do. So some kids start arm wrestling because there's nothing to do, and then one kid actually goes to Mr. Retard and asks her, and she and he, uh, the students like, "Hey, can we arm wrestle since I do anything?" And she was like, "Yeah, whatever." So you know, kids start arm wrestling, and you know, more time people, more people start arm wrestling, more people start watching, and actually Mr. Retard walks up to two girls who were arm wrestling, and she's like, "Wow, the two smartest people in my class." And then she just walked away. And then a couple minutes later, actually, there was like a huge crowd. There was two guys. One of them we're gonna name. We're gonna name one Jose. And we're gonna name one John. Okay. And well, they were arm wrestling. And she walks back over. And then as they're arm wrestling, she just puts down two detentions and tells both of them to fill them out. And then she's like, "Anyone else want one?" And everyone sort of backs away. And the funniest part was, is she was about to give detentions to everyone who participated. And like arm wrestling and the best part was is I was literally about to arm wrestle a girl we'll call her call her Jennifer so I was about to arm wrestle Jennifer literally we were about two seconds away from arm wrestling and then Miss Retard walks over and gives those guys attentions so we just slowly back up and she gave detentions like another person and then the two girls who were arm wrestling she gave detentions to them and then actually she uh, gave a detention to this guy, we'll call him, we'll call him Will. So she gave a detention to Will, and then she's like, okay, so tell me, who was it? Who was arm wrestling? And then Will was like, uh, it was pretty much everyone. And she's like, no, I want names, give me names. And he was like, it, it was everyone, like everyone was doing it. And she's like, I want names now. And he's like, I, I'm telling you, it was everyone. And she's like, okay, I guess you and me can go have a talk with the principal. And then he just sort of looks around at the whole class and he's just like, sorry guys. And then he just names off a bunch of people who were doing it. So I, I managed to get out of it. Uh, one of my friends, Max, who I do videos with often, uh, you know, his name's also Psycho, he almost got attention. He was at the computer actually typing his paper and the teacher, she just does not like him. And she's like, well, let me guess, or she, I can't remember exactly what she said, but she was trying to give him an attention, and he was like, you saw me over here, you were talking to me, helping with my paper, I've been working on my paper the whole time. And he barely got out of a detention. And she came over to me, and she was like, were you on wrestling? I was like, no, I was just over here, just working on my paper. And I wasn't. But that's how I got out of it. So at the end of that, about 12 kids ended up getting detentions. And this was right before spring break, like literally the day before spring break. So everyone got detentions and really like they're not like true detentions, I guess, at my school. I was at it was a lunch detention. And what would happen is you get the detention, you'd have to go home, your parents would sign it, and then the next day you'd give the teacher the detention back, and then you'd go to lunch and you'd like miss your whole lunch. You'd just be sitting at a table to eat your lunch, like by yourself, and then you'd go back with the teacher and do whatever they wanted you to do, like clean or organize or something. So it was like spring break and we all come back from spring break and the kids are all hoping that 
like the teacher forgot about all the detentions and everything and whether or not she did I can't remember like I never knew but there was one kid and we'll call him oh, it's a really, let's call him uh, we'll call him Lewis okay so uh, Lewis uh, goes up to the teacher because he didn't get attention he's just that kid you know he's like so did everyone has to turn their detentions right and she's like oh yeah and everyone everyone was mad at Lewis for uh, minding her and <laughs> the best part lunch rolls around so we're figuring out okay so who act because most of the time like people can just talk their way out of detentions so like out of the 12 people who were supposed to have lunch detention only like three or four people were actually serving their detentions. Everyone else got out of it. So, and the people who actually served their detentions were, were not happy. And yeah, that yeah, that's just that's just how Miss Retard is. As I said, not the best with dealing with problems. Yeah, that's just who she is. And I, you know, I have a, a lot more stories about her. And if you want to see any more stories about her, make sure to leave a like. So yeah, that's pretty much it for this video, guys. Yeah. Miss Retard, we can make this a series about her, uh, honestly. I don't know if that's good or bad. So yeah, more stories about Miss Retard, remember, leave a like, know to subscribe, and yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Peace out.